Rita Hart is out. The Democrat challenging the results in Iowa's second congressional district election for months now made the announcement this afternoon. KCCI's Rhea Spigner is following this tonight. Rhea, Hart says she is dropping the challenge. Right, so Hart had requested a U.S. House committee look at the results of the race, and Republican Marionette Miller-Meeks was certified the winner by six votes. But the Hart campaign was arguing that some valid votes were not counted, and if they had been, she would have been the winner. So in a statement today, Hart wrote in part, quote, despite our best efforts to have every vote counted, the reality is that the toxic campaign of political disinformation to attack this constitutional review of the closest congressional contest in 100 years has effectively silenced the voice voice of Iowans. It is a stain on our democracy that the truth has not prevailed and my hope for the future is a return to decency and civility. Hart went on to wish Miller Meeks well as representative of District 2, which covers much of Southeast Iowa. Miller Meeks was officially sworn into office earlier this year, but the decision today from Rita Hart officially puts an end to the process nearly five months after the November election. The Republican Party of Iowa released a statement this afternoon applauding Hart's decision and declaring victory. Now, KCCI has been covering the developments of this dramatic race every step of the way. It has always been about razor thin margins. The initial results of the race gave Miller Meeks a 47 vote lead. That led to a district wide read count, which shaved her lead to six votes. Hart has contended that 22 votes that were never counted were wrongfully excluded.